Perfect! Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Timor Avaritia. I still don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but this is so far the third game in the Timor series. Timor, maybe? And supposedly this one's very, very different than the other ones, but should have a lot of spooks and scares. Dear my dear nephew, if you're reading this now, know that I am long gone. You're the only one I can trust, so I give you the old house in my will. You've known about my experiments. I had a success. I managed to create, as I like to call it, a health potion. It helps to heal any person's wounds within seconds of drinking it. I hope you find some use of it. You can find them in the basement along with my other experiments. Some have not tested positively, though, so I hope you won't get into any trouble because of them. Take care, my dear nephew. Best wishes, your Uncle Frank. Okay, thanks, Frank! This is his last letter to me. His experiments must have killed him. I must find my uncle. But you said he was dead. You literally just, I just said this. But I don't have a very strong brain, so I'm going to continue down. Oh, okay. So the thing about the Time War games is that obviously the graphics were really simplistic in the other games, and I don't think that it's going to be any different in this game. But the thing about the other ones, oh, are those potents? Are those podians? Oh, oh. As you walk into the basement, you slowly are overwhelmed by the scent of a gas leak. You become dizzy and delirious, having a hard time remembering where you came from or why you were here. You spot a radio and some strange-looking light bulbs, somehow connected by wires to some batteries. What little do you remember is your uncle's will. You must quickly find a cell potion before the gas kills you. Oh! Throw light bulbs to see further, drop a radio to attract strangers in the basement. Pick up potions with E, use them with C. Okay, Q-R-E-C. I'll try my best to remember that. Here we go. Oh, hello. I got a pot onion! Oh, this is a very doom-like dungeon. Oh, am I just gonna be creating pot onions? Or taking pot onions? I mean, like the other time or- uh oh. The gas is slowly choking the life out of me! Is this what happened to Uncle Frank? Yeah, I don't know very well. But I suspect that there might be some deadly creatures in this dungeon. <laughs> oh! I suspect it correctly! <laughs> Oh, my time! My time is not good. I didn't even see that I had a minimap in the top. Oh god, do I have to go through all the spiel again? Oh god. Oh, at least it's not that bad. Alright, let's go, I guess. Hot damn. You know, optimization is an important thing in games, but let's try this again. I don't even know exactly what killed me, so... Light bulb? Why do I just have light bulbs in my pants? What am I, just walking around with a giant bucket full of light bulbs in my pants? Or, never mind, the bucket is my pants, I'm just walking in it. That doesn't seem good. That killed me last time. Oh, top left is my health. Oh. Uh, top left is my health. And the- Ooh, whoa, wait, whoa, 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 whoa! Radio! Take some of that! Okay, so top left is my health. The other- Whoa. Uh -oh. I don't like the sound of that. I think there might be some demons down here! What was my Uncle Frank doing?! My lovely uncle who never talked to me and granted me a house that was literally one bedroom on the top of a hill that's impossible to get to and not near any stores to shop from. What did my lovely uncle that I love so much do? Oh, I hope I don't get into too much trouble in this Dungeon of Nightmares. Speaking of which, I'm going to play Dungeon Nightmares very soon. Uh oh, what's that? <laughs> don't do none of that. <laughs> Am I out of, I think I'm out of light bulbs. My bucket of light bulbs have run out. At least I'll- ah, fuck you! What was that? Hey, don't be doing that. Think you can- Think you can get me? Huh? Huh? Don't you know who I is? I'm Markiplier. I'm the king of these horror games. You don't know nothing about nobody if you don't know about Markiplier and his ability to take on horror games. It's like my thing. It's like my jam, bro. What, you wanna come after me? Huh? You wanna come after me, bro? Huh? You know who I am? Huh? Please don't come after me. I'm really quite scared. Very scared. Anybody? Anybody in the darkness? Anybody? Oh, I should watch my minimap. It's actually kind of hard to follow. Oh. Uh. So I, I really am, I'm out of radios and I'm out. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did I? Okay, sorry. Sorry, just getting a little twitchy. Well, that's an interesting sound. Why don't you do it again? Louder and farther away from me so that I can hear it just the same, but you'll be farther away! Perfect, you! Hey, what the hell is with that, bruh? Come on! Why are you gonna be tangling with me like that, yo? 
Don't hip on my hoopty. I don't know what that means. I try. I heard it on the street once. I, I haven't been outside much. Okay, so it is. It is kind of like a maze, I guess. Uh, I'm trying to glance at the thing, but I move so quickly that it's impossible to follow. Ugh. What was that? Huh? Somebody playing a violin over there? You know how I feel about violin players. Uh oh. Oh, it's the alarm for telling everyone how good I am at this game and not dying. Boy, I sure love me. So, like, I don't have a lot to go on here. I don't have a lot of inspiration to talk about, and it seems like I could just follow this bow. What is that? Oh, I got a thing. I don't know what I got, but I got it. It was gold. I only caught a glimpse of it. It was very quick, and then it was gone just like that. And I seem to have run out of light bulbs, and I have no more radios. Oh, there's a thing behind me. But it's totally okay because I'm chill. I'm the chillest chill that I've ever seen. I'm so chill. Look at me. Look at me. Whoa. I saw something over there. I saw a spindly something. Kind of looked like a slender man, but I know he's been long dead for years now. He'll never make a return. Ever. Ever. Seriously, what kind of basement is this? What kind of Uncle Frank do I have? I don't even remember having an Uncle Frank. Frankly, huh, frankly, get it? <laughs> frankly. But frankly, I don't even remember talking about Uncle Frank. I don't remember Uncle Frank at family reunions. I don't remember Uncle Frank being anywhere in my life at any point. In fact, I don't even remember having a family at this point because there's poisonous gas. It's killing me slowly. Okay. All right, shit, I shouldn't have gone down that way. How do I, like, what do I do? I don't even know what the gold thing was that I got. I mean, I'm carrying it around in my bucket. It's, it's surely not a light bulb. Maybe a radio? No, not not that. Exactly not that. And I got a whole lot of- <laughs> Stop doing that! Hey, stop it! You're such a son of a bitch! Stop being an ass blasting bag of dicks. Of dicks! Uh -oh. oh god, I've gotten to the point where I've already taken pot and you- Hey, what the frickin' dick? How about you go fly somewhere else, you creepy coo? Yeah. Ah, go away. I don't like you. I don't like you. I don't like you. You're a floaty flu. What are you? What are you even? What are you, you trying to kill me, huh? I'm the streetest, chillest guy who's ever been on the street and chillin'. I saw Rocky once. I, I know that when you're on the street, you just sing around trash cans that are lit on fire. I'm not on fire. Alrighty then. Ugh! And did I mention ugh? That's what- Oh god! Oh, I failed finding my uncle, no joke! Where the hell would my uncle be? There's achievements here, I looked at this before, I didn't know what they meant. Oh, so apparently I woke in all the creatures, and there's a lost cat, and there's earn all the achievements, and find uncle's grave. Why is uncle's grave in his basement? Why is he in the basement? What, did he bury himself in the basement? Did the other creature be like, Oh, our poor creator that we probably killed. Also, there's a gas leak, but that don't bother us. Chug, chug, potion, potion. Oh, we shall bury him here. We shall make sure that he is interred in proper fashion. Oh, whoa, is that his relative? Get him, kill him, kill him. Where's this bullshit? What a load of baloney. I'm out of here. I ain't going in that house no more. Oh, I can't go further. There's an invisible wall. Maybe around the back I can just find Uncle's grave and this will be good. Whoa. Hello. Hi. I found a cat. Oh, goody goody gumdrops for me. Well, I can't take you with me because taking you down to the gas filled chambers would be horribly, horribly bad of me to do. Oh, hi. What the hell? Oh. I go very fast. All right, let's give this another goo. I'm not gonna use a radio and light bulbs are bullshit because they didn't give me anything. What a load of crap, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? What a load of pork. What a load of hork is hork. You know what I'm sizzling? Okay, I'm trying to look at the map a little better this time because the map actually does tell me a lot of detail about the environment and if I can find like a, some landmarks that I can actually use, 
then I should be fine going forward. I don't actually need to take all these potions, but it is good to act as a landmark for knowing where I've been already. So if I can just use that and the map at the same time, then I should be okay going forward. Is the kitty gonna help me? Is Pushy Cat gonna help me? I mean, it would be really impressive if this was all randomized, which I don't know if it is. Hello, who's there? Who's there? Who wants a sloppy kiss? I give nothing but sloppy kisses to strangers. That's not what I do. Don't quote me on that. that uh oh. Okay, so I'm going into a separate area over here. Dang, this place is big. Like, you'd think that the upstairs would have been a little more worked on. What is that? What is with, what is, what is that? I don't know what that is. I don't know what it do. All right, whatever, apparently it do nothing. Because I actually, I highly doubt this is randomly generated. Because frankly, you know, I, I, not that I'm trying to belittle the developer, it's just that if this much work went in the environment, I don't know if that much work would have been put into the programming to make it randomized. Is this a question? It's not like an insult to the developer, it's just comparing everything else to the level of quality that I've seen thus far. You know what I mean? You know what I'm feeling? You know what I'm saying? You get me? You feel me? You feel me? Don't feel me. Please don't feel me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Big guy, big face, big face man. Well, hey, how's it going there, buddy? Okay, so if I can just find the family coffin, you know, that the uncle was like, Oh, I'm dying. I must, uh-oh, I am gonna die. I saw you. Oh, slipped past like a boss. I think, I don't even think that was a challenge. I don't, I don't think he was actually anywhere near me at that point. Okay, so I think that was in the same place. So this is not randomly generated, which means that everything must be in a set location. So if I, I think that's another monster waking up because it said something about awoken old monsters. If I remember that correctly, it was specifically like that. Awoken old monsters. Old monsters all aw are awake. Whoa, 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 whoa. Some bitch in the face! I was ready to go slamming on your jugular with my kung fu chops! Oh man. I'll give it one more go. One more go. One more go to find my uncle. I gotta find my uncle! Why does the like the logo in the beginning, Timor Avaritia, which I don't know what it means, it looked very Christmassy for some odd reason. If I look on the map, there is an interesting landmark up here. Kind of like a locked away area that looks like just contained. So is there something? Oh, wait a minute. This is a false wall. There's something back there. Ah, false wall, eh? Well, I ain't been deterred by- Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, whoa. Okay, you're very slow, but I still don't want it. Okay. Damn it, I'm out of potent. Ah, oh, god damn, this was a mistake. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die from death poisoning from all the gooses. Yeah, thank you. Got it. Okay, so this appears to be a series of rooms. That didn't sound fun. Man, why am I such a potion shortage this time around? Okay, so if I can find one of these, something good. Potion. Ugh. Those noises don't sound too friendly. I mean, not that I care. There's gotta be something here. There's gotta be something here. Hello, how's it going, buddy? Don't you know that I hate you? Okay, so is there anything in here? Nope. Ah, God, I I'm trying to look in all the rooms. All the rooms. The room rooms. There doesn't seem to be. Oh, whoa. Oh, that was a chest. Okay, so I think I've been here looking in these little alcoves before. I'm pretty sure, anyway. Because I would have remembered. Or maybe not. This place is very big and disorganized. Even though it has a lot of open spaces, I'm just an idiot. Okay, I have definitely been in here. I know that. Okay, so if I cut straight across, then I might be able to find something new again. I, I still say there's a false wall back there, like where I found the, uh, the little alcove on the map. It, it, the map went forward, but this did not. It makes it seem like there's something hidden away. Beep, 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 beep. Rem kinda reminds me of like Earthbound music on the creepy levels. You know the creepy levels I'm talking about. Everyone knows the creepy levels. Poopy poopy in my pantsy poopy. Oh, God, yeah, chest again. All right. I guess the good thing about the light bulbs is that if I lay them down, they'll be there forever. I'm never gonna find him. I'm never gonna find my uncle. 
Oh God, why? I'll never find him. I'll never find my uncle. The uncle that I think I love so much and I knew all my life maybe? I don't know, the gas is really starting to get to me so I don't exactly know what I know and what I think I know is probably not true in any capacity. But there's alarms blaring and I'm having a good old time chugging these wonderful potions that probably aren't the actual source of my demise. But you know, it's okay. I'm doing fine. How are you doing, monsters? Oh, you look so good. Did you dress up for me, you fun guys? <laughs> I can't wait to go home and meet my uh, Hello. Hi. God, you sneak up on me so easily. <laughs> you little gooby. You little goober gabber. I'm gonna call you gooby. Cause you goob and gab all day long. That's all you do. Just gooby gabby. Seriously, it feels like someone just randomly interspersed. Oh, hey gooby. How's it going, gabby goo? Uh oh. Gotta be careful here. Oh, hey, how's it going, buddy? I don't know what that means, but it's probably bad. Okay, so gooby's around. Gooby's around a corner here. I don't want to get trapped. I would never want to get trapped. Ugh. The pressure's on. I feel the monsters crawling down my neck. Not crawling, breathing. And there's the alarm again. I wonder what it means. What does the alarm mean? Does it mean a mystery about my Uncle Frank? I think that's what his name was. I can't really remember at this point because I stopped caring. But I think there's a mystery to be solved here. And I'm going to get to the bottom of it. Or I'm gonna end up dead, which is m m the more likely case in this scenario. But before that happens, I'm gonna make sure that I take one of those bastards down with me. Or probably not do that either. I'm probably just gonna die horribly. I'm probably gonna scream like, oh, hey, whoa, hello, buddy. Uh-oh, wall, 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 wall. You're new. You're really new. I don't remember seeing you, you spindly bastard. Why don't you go eat a dong? Not that I have one to spare, but I mean, just go find one in this basement, if you don't mind. I mean, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, you know, make you work. I don't wanna make you work for your dongs. And again, what is with the red thing? Is that just a random thing that's supposed to scare me? Ooh, I'm red in your face. Okay. I think this is about the goodest time to come at me, bro. Come on, inhale my dong. Whoa. Alright, I failed at finding my uncle, but somehow I feel more accomplished for just stopping. So, that was Timor Avaritia. It was a different experience from the other Timors, but frankly, I think I kind of like the charm of the other ones more. It was very typical in the jump scares of what the original games did, but at least the jump scares were there, plentiful, and annoying. Which, in those three mixtures, sometimes you get magic, but this one was not bad. So, thank you everybody so much for watching. Check out the other Timor animators that were made. Both other games were animated by Cranberry. They're absolutely amazing. And also, I'm wearing my King of the Squirrels shirt. It's a new shirt that's on sale right now. There's a link down in the description. And all proceeds, or not all proceeds, but a portion of the proceeds do go to charity for Doctors Without Borders. So if you want to buy a cool shirt that's got a Markiplier's Hero thing, I think they're 20 bucks on the store. So check them out through the link. There's only a limited amount. They will sell out soon. So thank you again, everybody, for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. Blink, 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 blink.